Hi everyone, how are you? It is B. Welcome to my channel, Psychic Sounds by B. Thank you so much for joining me. This particular reading is for all signs of the zodiac, and this is the Psychic Astro for April 13th, the week commencing April 13th. Now, as all of you know, timing is quite fluid, and these particular energies might be happening to you now. Maybe they just recently passed, or they could be happening to you in the upcoming two to three weeks, but these are the energies that we are dealing with. Again, they are psychic astro. I do not claim to be an astrologer, but I am an astrology enthusiast. And so I do use both my psychic interpretations, my psychic downloads, as well as planetary aspects to bring this message to you. Again, I would like to let everybody know, thank you so much for all your likes, your shares, your subscribes. Please subscribe if you like these messages. Um, I do psychic astro, I do psychic tarot, and I also do a bunch of other stuff. For you, those of you interested in a membership to my website, you can go to the link below. You can also purchase a consultation with me. The membership can be canceled anytime you like. There you will get the extended Psychic Astro for this upcoming week where I add more information and I do additional card pulls for each of the elements as well. So those are ben very beneficial uh, every once in a while for, uh, for all of you out there. So please take consideration of that. And the other thing I want to let you know is when I do post the extended readings, they will be posted on or before the first day of the week. Okay, so I just want to make you aware the first day of the week that I am doing this for. So they will be posted by April 13th or before, okay, for the extended psychic astro. I will probably be doing the um, uh, psychic tarot tomorrow. Okay, so just want to make everyone aware of that. Let's go ahead and let's get into it, ladies and gentlemen. All right. So for the week of April 13th through April 19th of 2020, on April 14th of 2020, the sun in Aries squares Pluto in Capricorn at 25 degrees. On or around this day, the awareness that someone did not check the details will cause a brief but significant problem. Why didn't you check that? Does it get caught? Yes, for some, but someone is furious about it. For others, it was missed, and now they are scrambling to figure out how they can work around this mistake. It feels very volcanic on or around this day where something could really erupt. This may have something to do with a business partnership. Uh, this may have something to do with even a romantic partnership. So just be aware of that particular energy. There is a lot of me energy. It's a very ego driven energy around April 14th. Just use it to your advantage and don't get overly egotistical or overly conceited in your dealings. Then on April 15th of 2020, Mercury in Aries conjuncts Chiron in Aries at six degrees. And the sun in Aries scores Jupiter in Capricorn at 25 degrees. So on or around this day, there is another wave of communication regarding great healing and great movement forward regarding research and health. Someone is getting news on this day that is very healing and extremely promising. Unfortunately, there is still a need to be patient. However, for some, this information is not well received. So I want you to be aware that whatever information is coming out around the 15th, it is information that is, um, it's really positive information, but for some reason, it doesn't sit well with someone else. Okay, so just be aware of that particular type of energy that you may be dealing with. Then on April 18th of 2020, Mercury in Aries is sextiling Venus in Gemini at 11 degrees. Well, here is what we have been waiting for, ladies and gentlemen. Communication regarding a new beginning and a broad sweeping directive has been or will be deployed very soon. There is significant communication regarding the love of a new beginning or a new beginning that is based on love and dedication. While there is a level of detachment here, the love is undoubtedly present. 
There is passion regarding a reunion with a loved one if partners have been separated due to conditions outside of their control. Yes, for those of you concerned, there is a twin flame energy here. It is undeniable. If a Gemini or an Aries has not been feeling well, you will start getting stronger around this day. So Geminis and Aries, if you have not been feeling like you are yourself or if you feel like you've been swimming against the tide, things are about to turn to your favor. So I want you to be aware of that. You could be coming out of an illness or out of a sickness right around the 18th of April. All right. So guys, that is your quickie psychic astro. I hope that you liked it. Um, I really do appreciate these um, little quickie psychic astros for all of you out there that like to have that quick 10, 15 minute reading before you get started with your week. So there you go. There it is. Now, as all of you know, for my subscribers, please expect your extended psychic astro to be posted on the 13th of April or before. I wish all of you the best. Much light, much love, and many blessings. Namaste.